Uh, as the last speaker, I know you are all exhausted, and I'm tired too. But I, I will pretend that you are, you are all energetic. Hello, Toastmasters. I'm Morris. Today... <laughs> thank you, thank you. Today I'm going to share my personal experience with you. And, now, and I will talk about my experience in junior high school. I hope you will not follow my story and fall asleep. Uh, uh, plus one. Uh, two. <laughs> I remember, uh, is there anyone who didn't go to senior high school? Please raise your hand. Okay, most of you did go to the senior high school. I didn't go to the senior high school. Actually, I still didn't go to the junior high school too. I remember my junior high school teacher was a female, of, of course female. She was, uh, not now of course, she was beautiful and kind. And uh, my mom really liked her because she think, she told that she's a great, grateful woman. And uh, one day, my teacher visited my mom and she, call, she, call, uh, she brought a message to her. She said, if your son stay at home and play computer all days and she didn't show up in the class uh, in the future, she cannot, he cannot graduate uh, from the junior high school. After I realized that she really meant that I will be fired by the junior high school, I went to a school. But there's a problem. I have no idea what the teachers were talking about in the classes. Mathematics, history, uh, Chinese, and English, of course, and, and etc. Um, after, oh, plus one. Um, after, after, uh, but I finally got my junior high school uh, graduate certificate. I went to a college, five years institute, called the, the Institute of Technology of Delhi. It's the, the Chinese name is Delhi Jiu Xie Yuan. Uh, first one. I've, um, when I went to the college, I, still, I, I started to think that it's time to pray. So I, I go into trying to find my friends. But my friends all went to the senior high school and they told me that uh, the, senior high, the life in senior high school is all busy. They had no time to play with me, so I'm quite lonely. If I know there's a Warcraft now, that I, might, I might play Warcraft. But I tried, but I decided, there's an idea came into my mind. Why don't I just study to read and study? Uh, I told my I told my teachers in the new college. She's also a beautiful and <laughs> kind woman. I told her that I'm going to learn uh, English, and she gave me a magazine. It's called "That's Talking English." It's it's really a hard magazine to me. It's tough. I have to memorize it every week's new vocabularies, and I have to underline the vocabularies and the letter. I found out that I cannot underline anymore because each sentence I will have to underline. So, even though I still try to study hard, uh, try to be a good student. On my way, on my way towards a school, I will took bus. A bus will stop by a senior high school, and I saw I saw two high school students who were who were prepared preparing preparing uh, the student classroom. Um, they said, they said it's, it's, it's easy and it's boring. And, oh, it, they are really destroying my confidence in, in English because I'm still studying the last talk in English. Um, uh, from, from last talk in English to uh, the economist, I tried many years and uh, in the, in the end of my, my college, I studied to took the exchange for exam, and I chose NTU as my choice. Uh, after the first year, I failed, and uh, the next, and the, in, in 2007, and in 2008, I, I passed. That's why I'm here, and I can join this club with you. I think that dream is 
dream is something which you which is really a very variable we all have dreams that's why we are here our purpose and our goal might be different our dreams sometimes might be left by others but my personal experience told me that if you really believe something and you really want something you just try to do it in this case I think things are variable not, not only the, the, the end but also the procedures thank you to Toastmasters and thank you this is my speech thank you very much Thank you very much. Time for